Hey guys, and welcome to a very requested video. <laughs> Not very requested, but I've had a few requests and a lot of people are asking, oh, are you going to do a, a video about Sungri? Um, so I'm sorry that it's taken me so long. Um, but my my headspace has not really been up for kind of doing this video and i have tried to do this video a number of times this is probably like take 100 um and uh every time i look like look back and i'm just like no i said that wrong i don't want people to think that and so it's it's difficult for me because i i'm a vip i've been a vip for eight years i'm also a sunri stan and so for this to happen like literally it has broken my heart it literally has and um i f i want to state first of all that everything that sangri has been is currently being investigated for or being accused of or that people think he's involved with i don't support any of that and my heart absolutely 100 percent goes out to anyone affected by this case um the victims families friends everyone um so all i'm going to say is that at no point do i, I want i just want to make it absolutely clear that i do not support any of the accusations um towards someone however what this video is more about how i'm feeling as a vip which i think is potentially what some of you probably want just want to know how i'm doing um so thank you very much for for a lot of lovely comments that i get on um privately and on instagram as well um, it has been a rough six months. It's been like six months since the Burning Sun stuff and there's been a lot of momentum and traction with regards to this case. I mean, the, the latest thing, obviously like BI, what happened to BI is ridiculous. Um, YG leaving YG, I'm, I, I don't know how I feel about that one because he's still a shareholder. So is his brother. It's not going to change anything. Um, I also heard a rumor that this, the lady that's now the CEO, it um, just was the one that disbanded 21. I'm not sure if that's true. That's just a rumor that I heard. I'm, I'm not sure. Um, so I'm not really sure <laughs> why she is the place to be <laughs> these days. So I first of all want to just say that, um, that it's just a mess. And it just, I feel like somebody out there has got this little bag of information of scandals and they're just every now and again and when everyone's kind of like calmed down something else happens it just feels like that i mean at the moment this thing with daesung and the building that he purchased before he went into his military i mean it just feels like okay so now daesung's getting it um i mean i was really worried about top um coming back literally the highlight of my year was that little green box on the floor with the tea in it with the korean press all waiting for top to make a statement and he stood them up <laughs> i literally laughed my ass off i thought that was brilliant um and he went and spent time with people who actually care about him and still support him so i thought was, that was very well done so i like um so yeah it'd be interesting to see what the other members of big bang do because i literally would not if I was them, I would do the same. <laughs> um, Jiyoung is the next one to to come out of the military, um, followed by Daesung and Taeyang. And uh, I, I'm not sure what's going to happen. I think if I just address the future of Big Bang collectively, obviously Sungri has left Big Bang and YG. Um, so with the remaining members, I don't know what's going to happen. Um, I would like to tell you what I hope will happen. You might agree with me, you might not, but my hope is that when the rest of the members get out, they collectively leave YG Entertainment and create their own record company. And I'm not talking like in the next year or something, you know, in years to come. I, I don't know how long it will take, but that's kind of my dream for them to have their own company, to be able to do their own thing and to still be Big Bang. The VIP in me would very much like that. The dreamer in me would like them to re-sign 21 back in and then maybe the rest of the YG artists and just a middle finger up to uh, YG. So, you know, that's kind of <laughs> where I would like it to go. But whether or not it goes that way, I don't know. So, um, 
so yeah that's kind of how i'm feeling about the future big bang obviously it's in the balance and not quite sure what's going to happen with regards to my stance on sungri which i suppose is the main point of me making this video um uh, listen guys i'm i'm on the fence uh i don't know what he's done and what he hasn't done no one knows what he's done and what he hasn't done apart from the people who know like himself and um it feels really long-winded that there's six months down the line from burning sun and nothing has been proven nothing's been um confirmed he's not been charged with anything that's to say i don't think he's innocent in a lot of the factors um i do feel there are certain things that he has been charged with not charged because it's not been charged with him but the things that he's investigated um been investigated by and one of my biggest concerns is is this and is jong Hoon from ft island um and pardon me for a moment while i just have a little bit of a discussion about this because i am a big ft island fan um and jong Hoon was my bias he's always been my bias uh, so i can pick him can i um so when all that stuff came out about him and um jong -un, i can i can never remember the, how to pronounce the next the other guy the chat room stuff and I literally 100% disown Zong Hyun, um, and I hope that they lock him up and throw away the key. I think they are both awaiting sentencing for what they've done, and it's horrific. And I just cannot believe that that that's what that's what's happened. Um, Zong Hyun is also Sung Ri's best friend, and I don't know how involved Sung Ri was with regards to the chat room. Um, but he was in the chat room, he was part of the chat room, and he didn't do anything to stop them. I don't know what he was involved in regarding the chat room. Um, it's just like accusations and what hearsay, and I, so I don't know. But I'm worried because Jung Hoon is his best mate, and I feel like that's a big thing, you know? That's kind of something that I keep focusing on um so i think there's a lot of things that sungri has done wrong and i feel that that will come out um i don't think he's guilty of everything he's been um, accused of um but i do think he's guilty of something so i don't know what's going to happen i also don't know what's going to happen with regards to the inquiry because i don't know if there's a date i don't think there's a date yet for his military enlistment Obviously, he pushed it back to clear his name. That's what he said. Um, so, yeah, here we are, like, <laughs> four months later, whatever, however long it's been since since then, and he's not, it's still ongoing. Uh, obviously, he's still not been charged with anything, but, you know, if he decides he's to go into the military soon, then it'll be the military police that take over the investigation. So, um, I'm just going to take each day as it comes. I'm going to see how all of this pans out. Um, if somebody is found guilty, he will be punished. If he's not found guilty and the resolution is that there is no resolution, I literally have no idea what's going to happen. So, but for now, I'm just, I'm on the fence. Um, and I, I hope that um, I'm explaining myself in a way, if that makes sense. Like, you know, I've stand Big Bang for a long time. I've stand somebody for a long time. And then it's, it's a lot to let go. And I will never let go of Big Bang. I'll never ever let go of Big Bang. They're a big part of my life. So even going forward, you know, if things happen. I will cherish the eight years that I've been a VIP and the music that they have done. And I cherish my entire collection that I have. Um, and I'm, I'm, I kind of think of myself as quite fortunate in a fan base kind of way. As a VIP, um, I stand a lot of other groups. So I have a lot of other groups to kind of keep me occupied. Um, but I do feel for people who are just VIPs and just it's just awful just waiting, waiting for it to happen. I just want to be able to wake up and have a resolution one way or another. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much my video on the stance. Um, you'll you maybe you'll agree, maybe you'll disagree. I mean, whatever. Um, I will, you know, feel free to leave comments. I might not respond to all of them. It depends on the comment. Um and yeah we shall see watch this space see what happens um i'm waiting for tiong now 
waiting for Jinong to, to come and <laughs> see what kind of chaos that happens because whatever Jiong decides to do will be what happens so he's the boss he's the, the king of kings so hey watch this space anyway um I, I'm sorry that I have been null and void for so long I'm hoping to change that um so yeah I've got some videos that I want to 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 do so um yeah till then till next time guys ciao